Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Best Trends. Now in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the top 10 best Fortnite players in the world. Before we get into the video, I'm going to be giving away loads of gift cards that you can use to buy V-Bucks. To everyone who leaves a like on the video and turns my notifications on, be sure to comment down below that you've completed the steps. New winners will be included at the end of every video, so make sure to get entered on new videos early for the best chance to win. Recently, there has been an insane increase in Fortnite talent. So many new stars are rising and the game has now been taken more serious than ever. Fortnite has blown up an insane amount, but it's honestly crazy to think of how big this game has truly become. Job well done to Epic Games. But there are still questions remaining around who is the true best Fortnite player. So I figured that I'd go and make a video that shows who the world's best Fortnite players are. And who is the number one best player in the world. You may actually be very surprised on who is ranked number one. So make sure you guys stick around for that. Because the talent in this video continues to rise until there is the best. So let's move right on into the video. Number 10. King Richard, a very well-known Fortnite streamer who plays quite often with the man himself, Ninja. He has just about 1 million followers on Twitch, so congrats to that once you hit it. Man, you're only 5,000 away, so big congrats to him for 1 million followers when he does hit it, you guys. But King Richard is coming in here at the number 10 spot, and he's a very well-known and skilled player. Not all of these players may be very well-known, but you'll have to wait and see who makes the number 1 spot on the list. But the thing is, King Richard has 2,600 wins, and 1,900 of those wins are from solos. So clearly you guys can see that he holds his own. But King Richards, as you can see in the background, is an insanely good player. But have we really seen enough? Let's go and take a look at a couple of his highlights. Check this out. Oh, he's Bless. Number 9, Cypher PK. Cypher is a very, very good Fortnite player. The skill difference between these 10 players are going to be very minimal, so it's unreal, you guys. They are all so good, there isn't really a way to get much better than they already are. So this list can go either way. And I'm going to be placing these individuals in the order I believe is true, so we have Cypher now coming at spot number 9. He's a very well-skilled individual and has 2,800 wins total. And 2,300 of those wins are in solos. He is also the winner of the week one of Fortnite Friday alongside one of his friends, Nick Mer CS. Super insane player he is, and there really isn't much more to say, you guys, besides the fact that he was and still is the Fortnite Trap Tower legend. Let's go and take a look at some of his Trap Tower moments. Check this out. Forward a little bit. She needs to step forward a little bit. If she, if she steps right in the center of this, I can get her on the launch pad. You guys ready? Oh my god! Let's go! I got you! Don't you realize your actions have consequences? Brother, stop, man. What are you doing? You're making things weird. Come up here. <laughs> Yo, we had to do it to him, man. We had to do it to him. Number eight, TSM Daquan. Clearly, there are going to be a few TSM members a part of this list. And while I thought I had to make sure Daquan was on it as well. Later in the video, you may hear about maybe one or two more TSM members in the video. TSM clearly is one of the better teams in Fortnite, so Daquan was literally the triple, if not the quadruple pump legend. He has literally 2.1 million followers on Twitch, and which, that is his main platform. So congrats on 2 million followers, my guy. You're an insane player, and we need to go and take a look at some of his highlights. Check this out. I 
Number seven, Phase Jomok. This guy's edits are unreal. I've never seen someone be able to edit this fast. Literally, this player is definitely deserving a spot in this list. Clearly, Phase a very big team, and he's just one of their outstanding players in the squad that they have. They have four players on the squad, and every single one of them are insane. He has some pretty crazy highlights that I just have to show you guys. He isn't the biggest streamer for followers, but definitely holds a pretty good viewer count. He does though have 156,000 followers on Twitch, which is a very, very big number. And well, there's not much to say, you guys. He's just a beast, and I'm going to stop talking and go and let his gameplay show how good he truly is. Let's go and check it out. Okay, you know what? I can do that too. Number 6, Nick A30. Nick A is Klee a very well known YouTube streamer. Not just is he a very well known YouTube streamer, he's a very well known Fortnite player as well. A good one at that. But I feel his playstyle is more for pub stomping rather than you know those competitive scrims and like building tunnels and stuff like that. Nick doesn't really go that route, he's more of an open lobby game, like he's a pub stomper. Super cool and the reason he's more like this is because that's just a style of content that he does. You don't really get cool clips and stuff like that in scrims because everyone in there is just so good and you don't really hit trick shots or crazy edit fights like that and you know you don't really stomp on kids in scrims everyone is so good clear there are very good pub players that he goes against as well but you guys probably understand what i'm saying here i mean let's go and just check out some of this guy's highlights wait why am i in the passenger no <laughs> <laughs> oh should i drive you Where in you oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god, god. No! <laughs> Dude, I'm dead, man. There's no way. There's no way. No, bro. Keep going, dude. No way. I got one. Got the other. No keep going, keep going, keep going. Go. Nice little seven damage. Man, that was dirty. What are you doing up there, boy? Should we give him the 1-2 McGregor? I'm going to give him the 1-2 McGregor, guys. I hope your shotgun shot is as good as your hunting rifle shot. Boom! Oh, dang. Oh, what? I hit him. You're going to die. Yeah. <laughs> that was awesome. Number five, KSM Myth. Myth, literally one of the biggest... Fortnite streamers, and not just Fortnite, but streamers on the entire platform of Twitch. I believe he's the number third most subscribed Twitch user. And that's insane to tell you the truth. Literally, could you guys imagine? Just, it's unimaginable, you guys. Myth has 4 million followers on Twitch. And if you guys don't know who Myth is, I don't really know what to say. He used to be the best builder in the entire game at one time. But talent has ended up passing him, and now I'd say that he is the fifth best Fortnite player in the world. You guys may not agree with me on this, and to be honest, this entire list you could disagree with. But the thing is, this is what I believe, and honestly, everyone has their own opinion, so nobody's really going to agree with this entire thing, and I honestly respect that. This is just what I believe, and so Myth is, in my opinion, the fifth best Fortnite player in the world, and you guys, Myth is coming in fifth, so who in the world could be coming ahead of him? He is so good, could anyone be technically better than him? The first place player may be a shocker to some of you guys, so make sure you stick around for that. But let's go and take a look at some highlights of Myth. Yeah, that guy up there. Yeah, he's weak. What the f is this game, dude? They're all out of pickaxes, dude. They're all out of Dude, C9's f***ing wild. My brain is scattered. You can be out of the middle of the matter. Number four, Liquid Chap. Liquid Chap, some of you may not have heard of him because he's mainly in the competitive scene, but he's definitely still a very big figure in the Fortnite community. He's competed in the summer skirmish, and I believe he actually took a couple wins in it as well with Not Vivid. 
just insane who he is as a player. He doesn't stream with face cam, but his gameplay is so entertaining that he doesn't need one to make viewers stay and enjoy the content. Chap has 125,000 followers on Twitch and is one amazing player. Liquid as an entire squad is insane. But let's go and check out some of Chap's highlights. Actually, I'll grab it after I use all the C4. Let's go rush him. Come on. Wait, they're on our head? What the f Ramp up. Well, I'm ramping with you. Oh my god, he's a laser beam, brother. What the f on me? Get destroyed, Horrify. Welcome to Power Town, brother. Where do you think you're going? Number three, FaZe Cloaksy. Ah, FaZe Cloaksy. Such a good dude, literally has won Fortnite Friday like four times. That's insane. Making almost a yearly salary in four weeks, just working one day a week? Unimaginable. $40,000 he got for around like 30 hours of work or something around that. Just counting the time he actually played, not counting his preparation obviously to the tournaments, that would be an insane amount of hours. But playing in the tournaments himself, probably 30 hours total, and while winning $40,000 in 4 weeks, working 1 day a week, he deserves the number 3 spot 100%. Not just that, but he is the FaZe team captain. He's meant to be on this list. Let's check out some of this man's highlights. Let's go, dude. Let's go. That was a good game. Number two, Ninja. Clearly, some of you right now may be very mad at me for not putting Ninja at number one. And then there are some like, yes, because we all know who's going to be coming at next because he hasn't been mentioned in the video. But you guys, this is like I was saying before. This is all random. This is just who I believe. It's my opinion. Clearly, Ninja and the next person are so close. Everyone in this list, you guys, are so close in skill. Like, this order could be mixed up in any... Di this order could be mixed up anywhere. It's RNG, you guys. This is so random. Every game is different. But I'm just going off what I personally feel because everyone in this video clearly are insane players at Fortnite. Every single person in this video is... They're just nasty at the game, you guys. So... But if you guys disagree with me, I 100% respect that. Right now, you guys, I want you to go and comment down below who you believe the 10 best players are. And let's see how close our lists are in the order of you guys think as well. But you guys, let's go and take a look at some of the highlights from Ninja. Kids are there for free, right? When somebody yeah, pretty much, yeah. You don't pay it for free. You don't pay it for free. It's amazing. Man, I'm just like one step. Number one, Face Tifu. The things this guy has gone through becoming a Fortnite streamer. Getting hacked and just having problems like this recently is pretty insane. And I have to say that coming between Ninja and Tifu. And I have to say that deciding between Ninja and Tifu, this was a very close call. They're different players by all means. They are just so good, and I just may think that Tifu is a tad bit better than him. Even though obviously, like Ninja is an absolutely insane player, amazing entertainer, everything is great. But Tifu is gonna be taking the crown in this video. He is just the better, com he is just the a bit better competitive player, and this is going purely off Fortnite skill. Just by a hair, did Tifu end up winning this battle? Literally, anyone else in this video could have been number one, but I'm just gonna be going and choosing Tifu as the victor. So you guys, he is given the crown in here, and well, congrats to him. Let's check out some of his highlights.
Well, there you have it, guys. That was the top 10 best Fortnite players in the world. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to slap a big old thumbs up on it. Not just that, but the giveaway winners from the last video's giveaway will be in the pinned comment of this video. As well, you guys, make sure to follow me on Instagram at it's Wyatt YT is on the screen right now. Follow me because every single person that wins the giveaway will need to be contacting me on there due to YouTube removing their YouTube messaging system. So if you want to be contacted as a winner, make sure you go and DM me on there if you are a winner of the giveaway. Anyways, though, you guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.